Hello, this is Photography Gamer. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm reviewing Golf Club Wasteland for the PS4. The game is also available for the Nintendo Switch, Xbox and Android. Golf Club Wasteland is a dystopian golf game developed by Demagogue Studio. The game sees you play as a rich golfer who returns to Earth for a round of crazy golf amidst the derelict world that the elites have left behind. So what's it like to play? Well, it's a basic and simple experience with buttons for selecting the angle, power and striking of your shot. Aside from that, you can zoom in and zoom out to get a better lay of the land, and that's about it. Generally, the stroke play works quite well with some cool holes to navigate your way through. Putting isn't so great though, as the length of your power gauge doesn't seem to correlate to anything in particular, meaning it's a bit of a lottery. The game features over 30 holes to play through. At the start, you'll be breezing through it, but the complexity and challenge does increase quite considerably as you progress. You'll be doing shots from platform to platform, avoiding hazards or using buttons to open doors and many other tricky situations. Think of it like crazy golf in the apocalypse. Visually, it's pleasant and colorful in terms of the experience, interesting you know, level design, quirky characters, and you know, a good visual interface, I would say. The sound, however, doesn't get anywhere close to the levels of the graphics. The game's narrative is told via a radio soundtrack. It's called Radio Nostalgia from Mars, but it should have been called Radio Cringe Fest. The music choices on the radio are bizarre and are so out of sync with the game, it feels like someone put their iPod on shuffle and just hoped for the best. The stories are also really tiresome and honestly, after 10 minutes of listening to it, I had to turn the volume down or off completely as it just ruined the experience for me so I could just enjoy the golf. Okay, what's good and what's bad? What's good? Visually, it's a pleasant and easy on the eye experience. Stroke play is fun and the later levels provide a decent challenge. What's bad? The radio station audio is an unmitigated disaster and almost ruined the whole experience. The putting is a disaster and the novelty of it wears off almost immediately. So what's the verdict? Golf Club Wasteland, it's a nice idea. You know, have a visually pleasing round of crazy golf on a derelict version of Earth but that completely wears off remarkably quickly and the incessant annoyance of the radio almost ruined it for me. Saying that, for pure stroke play, I did find some pleasure in it, but it's not a game that I would play again or will last you more than a day or two. So if you see it on the sale, maybe give it a go, but aside from that, I would probably give this one a miss. So my score for Golf Club Wasteland is 5 out of 10. Okay, that was the review. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. This is Photography Gamer signing off. Thank you.